how to find mean and median in different situations and with different methods is being explained you in class 9th and 10th class syllabus in videos very properly if you are not able you can just go you can recall that how to find the mean how to find the median in different type of problems with different type of methods now in the class 11th i want to tell you what is a new concept after mean and median the concept is find the mean deviation about the mean of these data so the question is the if data is this data is the numerical information that is given first information that is x1 x1 is 12 x2 is 3 x3 is 18 x4 is 17 similarly dot 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 we can say x18 is 1 x19 is 0 and x20 is 5 that is observations of some thing are given 12 3 18 dot 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 so i have assumed these observations are x1 x2 x3 and in all the observations are 20 in the number so last observation x20 is what 5 i want to introduce you how to find the mean deviation but first what about mean you know what is the mean mean is the sum of all observations i is equals to here 1 to 20 upon 20 so sum of all these observation if you will go it will be 200 and number of observations 20 so mean is coming out to be 10 we want to tell you i want to explain you how we will find the mean deviation about the mean now the question comes what is this meaning deviation to find the first deviation d1 finding first deviation means mod of first observation minus mean that has come as first observation is 12 and the mean is 10 its mod value is 2 then second deviation d2 is mod of second observation minus same mean that become 3 Minus ten, minus seven, but mod is seven. Similarly, as two deviations I told you have been come out two and seven. Similarly, all twenty deviations you will calculate how these deviations will come. First deviation will come if ten is subtracted from twelve and taken mod. Second is three minus ten then mod. Third is eighteen minus ten. Fourth is seventeen minus ten. Fifth is four minus ten, sixth is nine minus ten, seventh is seventeen minus ten, and mod every time. And last d twenty. Similarly, we can calculate the last mod that is five minus ten. Its mod that is what is coming five. I want to tell you how to calculate the mean deviation. So the mean deviation, mean deviation. will come out sum of all deviations d1 plus d2 plus d3 plus dot 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 plus d20 divided by 20 sum of all deviations will be 124 and that will be divided by 20 124 upon 20 that comes out to be 6.2 this 6.2 is the mean deviation of this data as per the requirement and as per directions you need to follow as and when you want to calculate the mean deviation we have to calculate first what we will calculate in the first step the mean of observations with any of the method as explained you in your previous classes then we will subtract each of the mean from observation will come out the deviation and sum of deviations upon number of de observations will give us mean deviation as explained you in this problem it is coming out to be 6.2 now i am taking another example where i will calculate again the mean deviation 
in the previous question mean deviation was calculated about the mean but here the mean deviation is required to calculate about the median to calculate the mean deviation about median of the given data first of all we will calculate the median methods of finding the median are also explained to you in the previous class so i am telling you how we will get the median of the given data to get the median first of all all these observations will be arranged so that's why which observation will be taken at the first number 3 then again 3 then we will take 5 then after 5 we will take here 4 then we will take 5 after 5 there is no 6 so we will take 7 after 7 we will check is there any 8 then no then 9 after getting 9 we will take 10 after 10 we will check is there 11 it's no then we will take 12 after taking 12 we will we will check that is is 11 after 12 13 14 15 16 17 then it is 18 19 and 21 here the number of observations 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 11 it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 11 so number of observations as one of the observation 3 is repeating so we will take we will write as it is so answer of n is what 11 in case it is odd what we need to do we just have to find the formula in case of the odd median is given by n plus 1 upon 2th observation that is 11 plus 1 upon 2th observation that is 12 upon 2th observation that is 6th observation so six observation in the arranged data 1 2 3 4 5 6 it is what 9 so the median of the data is 9 now what we need to do you simply have to calculate the deviations to calculate the deviations method is again absolutely very simple we have to calculate d1 that is first deviation that is what 3 minus 9 that is minus 6 but mod makes it positive 6 second deviation then again 6 then third deviation 4 minus 9 but because of mod become 5 then fourth deviation 5 minus 9 become 4 and the fifth deviation d5 d5 comes as what that is 9 minus 9 0 that is 7 minus 9 that is 2 d6 comes 0 d7 comes out to be 10 minus this 9 so we are obtaining what the deviations which is the what is the deviation in the next it is 1 then d8 to calculate d8 we have to subtract 9 from 12 that is 3 then d9 d9 will be obtained by subtracting 9 from 18 that is what 9 d10 d10 can be calculated 19 minus 9 that is 10 and d11 that is 11th deviation that will be what 12 after getting deviations what we need to do we want to calculate its mean deviation mean deviation means mean of the deviations means mean of deviations that is known as mean deviation so <clears throat> what are the deviations 6 plus 6 plus 5 plus 4 plus 2 plus 0 plus 1 then plus 3 plus 9 plus 10 plus 12 divided by 11 the resulting value of this part will give us the mean deviation of the problem about the what this is 58 divided by what 11 so if i divide it it will be 5.27 this is the mean deviation of the problem about the median now i am telling you one more problem how to calculate the mean deviation in case when xi and fi is given 
if data is not discrete. Find mean deviation about the mean means two things we need to calculate the deviations we need to calculate the mean. So, xi observations are given two frequency is two for observation five frequency is eight for observation six frequency is 10 for observation 8, frequency is 7 for observation 10, frequency is 8 and for observation 12, frequency is 5. So, to get mean deviation, we need deviations. To obtain deviation, we need mean. To need, to complete the need of mean, we have to calculate xi into fi. So, this, this data is being put vertically. xi 2, 5, 6, 8, 10, 12. 2, 5, 6, 8, 10, 12 are being put here and fi it is 2, 8, 10, 7, 8, 5, 2, 8, 10, 7, 8, 5. For finding the mean in such situation we can need to calculate xi into fi. So, 2, 2 is a 4, 5, 8 is a 40, 6, 10 is a 60, 8, 7 is a 56, 10, 8 is a 80, 12, 5 is a 60. Sum of all xi and fi is 300 and sum of all observations is 40. So, the mean is sigma fi xi upon sigma fi that is 300 upon 40 comes out to be 7.5. Now, from each observation, if 7.5 is subtracted and taken the mod, we will get the deviations. Method of obtaining the deviation is what? First, subtract mean from each deviation, each observation and then take the mod. So, 2 minus 7.5 is 5.5 negative but with the help of mod this become 5.5. 5 minus 5 7.5 with mod 2.5. 6 minus 7.5 is minus 1.5 and mod is this. Similarly, 8, 10 and 12. Mods are obtained di. Now, di into fi to obtain the mean deviation when frequencies are given we have to follow fi into di or fi into mod of xi minus x bar that is the expanded notation of the deviation. So, 2 into 5.5 is 11, 8 into 2.5 is 20, similarly 10 into this and all that is calculated and their sum is 92. To obtain the mean deviation, what we have to do? The product of fi into di is sum need to be divided by fi. So, that is 92 when divided by 40, result comes out to be 2.3 which is the mean deviation of this problem.